Went to our local Walmart. Only thing open. And picked up some LED Edison string lights. Uh, we haven't used them before, so we're gonna do an unboxing see the you know quality of them and we'll see what happens then all right right now we just have Christmas lights inside I'll show you real quick they don't do anything um, and when it's pitch black out here yeah it does a little bit other than that it doesn't do anything okay did you have to cut it open no Go right open. so here we go as I said, don't know the quality of them yet. Hard plastic. Looks good. Looks like the regular Edison bulbs. LED. We're going to get them strung out here and try to find out about how long they are. Love this cardboard. Okay. Let's get some cardboard out of the way. Um, it does have an adapter to add more lights, like your regular Christmas tree lights. Something weird on the end. No idea what it is. Okay, so as you can see, um, they are about 10 inches apart in between each light, and it's about 30 foot. Um, I've stretched them out as far as I can on our maps. Did you want to stretch two of them apart to yeah, we can do that. show? So they are about about a foot apart, 10 inches to a foot apart, I w I'm guessing, without actually measuring them. And we're going to get them strung up inside the gazebo and then turn them on and see how they are. I had to run back to Wally World and grab another box. 30 foot, don't go very far. On a nine foot gazebo. It literally ate up that first strand. I got up to the front top of the door, across the door. Got almost all the way around, and then boom, ran out. So, second box, be back in a minute. We put our Christmas lights back up because the LED Edison bulb doesn't produce a lot of light. So if we want a lot of light in here, we can turn the Christmas lights on with the LEDs. But if we don't want a lot of light, then all we have to do is just unplug the Christmas lights and then we have just the um, Edison LED lights. But so far it's been working really good. <laughs> 